Okay, hello everyone. Um, welcome back to episode 6. <laughs> You're probably wondering what happened to episode 5 of our Let's Play. Well, I want to tell you that I just forgot to bring it out or whatever. It's done. It's not done. I've recorded an hour's worth of footage and for some reason my audio just wouldn't record. I didn't check beforehand, I wasn't thinking about it. For some reason OBS has just not recorded my audio, it's recorded my webcam, it's recorded my screen, it's just not recorded my audio. Yeah, <laughs> which is rubbish. Now I could possibly bring out the video with a voiceover but the problem is that my camera is actually like linked to my sim screen so I don't just place it on it's just there and I can't take it off um, once it's recorded so you would literally be seeing me talking but it wouldn't actually be the words coming out of my mouth if you get what I mean plus if I tried to say everything that I said in the previous episode then that would literally take ages like literally ages to edit it was a bit of a fail and i want to apologize to everyone for this mishap i think what happened is i did a major kind of windows update yesterday and i think that's maybe affected it somehow because i haven't touched any of the settings if anyone has any ideas as to how i can try and get the audio back i am up for suggestions <laughs> I mean, I've tried everything. I've been on to OBS support. I'm try I'm waiting for them to get back to me. I wanted this video to come out on Saturday, which hopefully this one will come out on. Anyway, I'm just going to tell you what happened in episode five. To be honest, not a lot happened in terms of progression. So I'll tell you what happened. I've written it all down, like everything that I can remember what happened. We got with Tyson. So our relationship with Tyson has improved. Um, um, we had our first kiss, which was beautiful. We haven't woohooed yet. We haven't taken that relationship to the next level yet, but we are now lovebirds. We also got promoted in our job. So we were previously on level four. I think it was like utilities something, but when we are now a civic planner um, and the next step is to become a policy planner. So the next thing we have to do is get to logic skill five. So that should be fairly easy to do and hopefully we'll do that in this episode. We updated our fabrication level. Now we are still on five. We did make a candle for the first time. It's in our inventory somewhere. Yes, here it is. We made a sky dipped candle. Talking of Tina, Tina who's leaving now, she made us another gift. She gave us an upgrade part or something. So nothing to exciting. We also voted on a new community lot right at the start of episode five. We voted for the community garden. We ended up getting the maker space, which wasn't very useful to us because we literally have everything that we need just now. So we did vote for the community garden, yet there were no votes for anything else yeah it changed back into the maker space which is a little bit annoying so hopefully in this part we can get the community garden because living in a flat obviously we don't have access to a garden and we don't have all of the plants and stuff like that we just don't have the space we have the fabricator in this room and we also have the candle making station over here if we do need a recycler we can always head to the one in port promise because the community space in port promise has a recycler anyway so we can always go there if we need to we also got a new NAP voted in and it was the green initiatives. I'll show you. As you can see, the world has changed a little bit. So we've got these wind turbines popped up everywhere and it's just looking a lot nicer and there's not as much rubbish around. So it's really nice to see. It's, it's nice that it's not all like horrible anymore. But in terms of this episode, I think what I want to do, because it came up with a pop up just there, it said the voting period has opened. Max neighbourhood action plans are currently active. Petition to repeal at your mailbox or the nearest public voting board for a chance to reopen voting in the next period. So the max you can have is four. So we need to repeat 
heal something in order to get a new one basically so out of all the ones that we've got and i'll show you all the ones that we've got probably the one that we want to repeal is power conservation just because it's so annoying <laughs> so i think we're just going to repeal the power conservation so once the five required signatures have been gathered the chosen action plan will be repealed at the end of the current voting period any signatures acquired during this process will be reset regardless of the repeal success okay so i think what we have to do is basically go up to people is this best is best like dodgy she just seems a bit dodgy okay ask for a repeal signature and we'll ask Bess too. Why not? We can try and get two signatures here. I also want to try and get that community garden, as I said. I w want to hopefully get promoted again. So all we have to do is just increase our logic skill, which shouldn't be too hard. And then the last thing we have to do is, well, that I've written down, is maybe make some more candles. So we've made one so far. It can tell us here how many people have signed the petition. We've currently got no one. We need to try and get five signatures before Monday, I'm guessing, when, when the vote closes. So that's going to be a task, I think. I think what I'm going to do is I'm going to get her skills up. We've got the day off tomorrow, so we can do a lot more in terms of her skills and stuff like that. And um, I'll meet back up with you when we've got her needs up. Okay, so I've got her needs up fairly well. Okay, for some reason it was like glitching and every single time I would try and get Susie to do something she just wasn't doing it but it looks like she's it's working now I'm just getting her to die for some deals and then I think what we'll do is we'll maybe head to the Port Promise community lot because even though we do have a recycler still in the community space over here I just don't think it's as good like the dumpsters aren't as good <laughs> in this community but should we grab a shower i mean there's not really much point is there we're just wasting time so we're going to head to port promise okie dokie so let's dive for some deals in this dumpster because this dumpster seems to have a glitch where you can just dive for deals as many times as you like and i'm living for it how about you just move out of the way okay we're just gonna dive for as many deals as we can oh it's tyson here do we do it <laughs> let's do it why not is he here where is he this could be the thumbnail ladies and gents let me get in the perfect angle for this thumbnail right here oh no he's, he's leaving bye <laughs> our hygiene is literally like so bad why is it whenever i want to use the dumpster someone just comes over and uses it like what's all that about so we use the dumpsters in this area this one doesn't have a toilet so <laughs> i think we'll quickly head to the maker space use some of the facilities and then we can use the recycler there and we can get some more points for fabrication i also forgot to tell you that in my inventory i can't show you here but i sold all the things that i made in my inventory i sold them through build mode basically because i was going to try and find a way of selling them like on a sales table like you know you get in city living but the problem is is that i, I didn't realize that because it's such a big item it won't fit on the table so the only things that you can really sell on that table is like the fizzy juice candles and stuff like that because of that the marketplace isn't very useful for us so i'm gonna just try and make as much fabricated stuff as i can and try and get my money up because we're, we're doing pretty well like i think at the start of the episode that i filmed earlier it was maybe at about like five or six thousand simoleons so we've pretty much doubled that which is which is good but we might as well get our fabrication skill up while we're here oh tyson's calling us i'm going to ask you something important okay so here it is it's cereal soup uh no you and i are on the same page the whole idea is crazy kudos what <laughs> it's not soup though is it because cereal is milk whereas soup is like stock but yeah okay weird we're just going to fabricate as many things as pos. We'll also vote while we're here, just so I don't forget. Tomorrow we need to try and get some more signatures. We can actually do that maybe while we're here with this girl. Okay, so it looks like she 
yeah, she did sign. Good, good, good. She's she's doing social distancing here. We'll ask for a repeal signature. Did that work? I don't think it did. Okay, she signed. Good, good. So we've got two so far. So we just need three more. Wait, is that Tina? Oh, yeah. Tina, Tina will help us out, won't she? She better help us out. That was a beautiful moment. I mean, to be honest, if she if she didn't sign, she'd have some cheek. <laughs> right, if the community card doesn't work this time, I'm going to be quite upset. We'll come back and check it tomorrow. But in the meantime, I'm going to send Susie home, get her needs up, and then we will return to the community space tomorrow and hopefully level up on fabrication and see if we can get a few more signatures. Okay, so Susie is just eating some salad. She's watching some TV. Her needs are pretty good now. Unfortunately, we have a thunderstorm, which is not great if we were going to head to the makerspace today. But I think what I want her to do is try and level up in logic. So in terms of logic, we are on four. To be honest, we've kind of wasted Sunday, which isn't great. But the weather's nice now, so I don't really know what's going on. It's apparently mysterious weather. Oh, okay. So all planting efforts for green initiatives in Conifestation have been completed. Residents, enjoy your greener, fresher neighbourhood. You've earned it. So we've got loads of solar panels and stuff like that, which is really nice. We can't vote on a new neighbourhood action plan, I don't think. Oh, someone's trying to repeal green initiatives. How rude. <laughs> okay, so we try. We need to try and get some signatures for the power conservation. Do you know who it probably is? It's probably old Jeffrey, because he's like, oh, well, you know, I get money, so why would I do that, you know? Get her signature on the petition, and we'll get Dominic too. Why not? Yes. Okay, so we've got the right amount, so this will be repealed when voting closes. Interesting. I don't really know how that works. I don't I want the green initiatives I don't want it to stop uh, so we have to wait for these to go and then we'll get new ones maybe next week Sunday's kind of been lost to us really I'm gonna do a bit of fabrication I don't think this part will be very interesting what I'll do is I'll get my I'll get the fabrication skill up I will maybe try and get her logic skill up and then I'll get her needs up we'll get her to go to work then we'll come back and meet me back here at Monday at six o'clock when she finishes work and we'll see what position we're in then. Okay, so Susie is just about to come back from work. We got her logic skill up to just over half of what it needs to be. <gasps> Voting is now closed. Power conservation was repealed. Yes. We did it, guys. We did it. I don't know why, but her sleep goes down like so much. It's kind of annoying. <laughs> We'll get we'll get her her sleep up a bit then. We'll get her needs up. Wait a second. We we need to quickly check the community lot. Where is it? Oh yay! It's changed. Okay, so we so it looks like we've won the community lot as a community garden, which is fab because that's what we wanted. And it's got the insect boxes here too, so that's great. We don't need the maker space, and we also don't need the marketplace just now. I think the community garden is the one that we really needed, and thankfully we have we have it. Hopefully it won't change until I say so. <laughs> but in terms of just now, what we want Susie to do, I think what we want her to do is try and get promoted basically we'll get her to read logic too i mean the reading stuff's pretty boring so i'll skip this and i will contact you hopefully when we've leveled up in logic skill okay we're on 98 percent, 99 percent, 100 percent. okay <laughs> we, we managed to get her logic up literally an hour before she's going to work our needs are pretty bad but we managed it we'll meet back up at six yeah her needs are going to be pretty low again but i do want to go over to the community garden and check it out it's just her energy that's so low like all the time but i will get her to sleep for a few hours let's quickly head over to the community garden 
and we can see what it's like why not okay so apologies for it being quite dark but we have some garden boxes here we have the insects here oh my gosh so i think probably the most interesting us uh, thing for us is these little insect boxes let's nurture one. Oh, that's so cute that's adorable i mean i wouldn't do that in real life <laughs> no way okay so we need to collect insects so we can't collect them yet they are growing well fed but they're not ready for collection okay i think this community space is going to do us the world of good i think it's probably the best one that we've got we might get promoted you know it'll either be today or tomorrow so if in this episode we can get promoted that would be great so that's what i'll do i'll get her needs up we will head to work and we'll see what position we're in at six o'clock today later on today okay so we are back from work she's pretty tense because she wants a holiday and to be fair don't we all we all need a holiday every now and again and Susie is no exception but in terms of getting promoted we didn't get promoted today but we will get promoted tomorrow because we are pretty much on excellent which is fab our needs are pretty good we're not going to complete the master maker in this episode let's face it but I think what I'd like her to do is I'd like to finish this episode on a bit of a high, a bit of a kind of chill note. And I think she should go on a cheeky date with old Tyson. We did improve things with Tyson in the last episode. We will ask him on a date. Why not? Did he say yes? Oh my God. He said no. Oh my God. That's so sad. What well, do you know what Tyson? Right. That's it. He's gone no i'm not having it if you can say if you say no to this then i don't know what's wrong with you susie's a lovely girl she cares about the environment and all that how very very rude well do you know what tyson bye bye hun you're not getting with us again you have broken all ties you weird soup liker we'll just go and find someone else i mean obviously susie's upset she's been rejected let's face it but she doesn't need she doesn't need him look she's upset she doesn't need him right you don't need no man in your life in terms of promotion we know we're going to get promoted um she just wants to kind of be alone you know she's been rejected today so she's in she's she's quite sensitive and oh my god oh my god she's just been abducted by aliens what the <laughs> what what in how i'm actually shocked in the two three years that i've been playing the sims four my sim has never been abducted by aliens <laughs> and now it's just happened like out of the blue okay um i feel like we need to leave this on a cliffhanger we're gonna we're gonna finish the episode here susie's just been abducted by aliens we don't know what's gonna happen what's gonna happen when she comes back but at least she just walked outside and got abducted but i hope you enjoyed the episode guys and again i want to apologize for episode five but i've pretty much told you what's happened anyway and hopefully in episode six we've kind of covered what what happened it wasn't an awful lot to be honest but yeah i hope you enjoyed episode six again please leave a like if you enjoyed the video and please do leave any comments that you have about how we can improve or what you've liked what you haven't liked i'll see you on the next episode hopefully it will be exciting and we will start on the cliffhanger we will start by finding out what happens to susie when she comes back from outer space i'll see you in the next episode i hope you have a great weekend bye